Pi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing day of September 30th, 2020. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that NASDAQ 100 ETF is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.2%. You may expect now a sell return of 4.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $265.37. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $277.84, unless is overvalued. On the put option table, NASDAQ 100 ETF has a striking price at $266. For this option, the actual put price is not available but we expect a possible put price at $0.08. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bear normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a strong opportunity to buy energy sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $32.3. For call option, a possible call price is at $0.18. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell technology sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $116.16. For put option, a possible put price is at $0.01. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Financial sector ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the BOLO class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Material sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Expect a possible call of consumer staples ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell.
Technology Sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Communication Sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Utility Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.